Hi, I'm Kip from KipHakes.tv and today I am unboxing something. Now this could be a fun little something, maybe. Now this is the AlcoSense XL breathalyzer. Yeah, it's an actual breathalyzer. And uh, this is designed to tell if you're uh, over the legal limit of alcohol. Now it's ideal for the morning after. You know, when you've had quite a few drinks the night before and you think, Am I still over the drink drive limit? I think we've all had moments like that. And thankfully, I've never got into a car when I've been feeling like that. But this should, in theory, give a bit of added reassurance that you're under or over the limit. So yeah, we're gonna, uh, we're gonna unbox this and have a little look at it and see how it works. I've not drunk anything except tea. So um, I might have a cheeky drink at some point and then test it with this but yeah this is specifically designed for the morning after i don't think it's ideal for like having a few jars and then just getting in your car and hoping for the best you know this is more for your kind of uh, rather than your uh, it's designed in britain it's got a 64 millimeter version of the 200 millimeter versions that they use in the uh police roadside breath breathalyzer so uh, yeah it's got the same kind of fuel cell it's just a little bit smaller so that's that's good that's good hopefully you know should give you sort of fairly accurate results now with anything like this don't ever bet your driving license on it these things are only ever a guide okay so you know the police officer won't probably accept well I tried on my Alco Sense XL and it said I wasn't drunk because their machines might say otherwise. This is just a guide, okay? So yeah, this is uh, unboxing it and it says uh, designed by o Alco Sense in the UK. I like that. Okay, look at this. Look, that is the guy. So it's got um, a one in one and a bit inch uh, screen there and this unit costs just under £100, so that's not too bad at all if it saves your driving licence. It could be worth its weight in breathalysers, I don't know. So what else have we got in the box? Okay, so we have got a uh, micro USB cable, there's a micro USB port there. I don't think it charges through that, does it? No, it doesn't. We've got some alkaline batteries included, some three AAAs, that's obviously what this takes. Quite quite a big uh, instruction manual this is in English and in Polish I think what do we have here oh look we've got like actual tubes how many tubes have we got we've got one two three we've got five tubes so it's like an actual breathalyzer and they're all individually wrapped that's cool I'm not gonna waste those I was just you know going to have a go for fits of giggles but I won't do that we'll We'll get some actual alcohol in my system at some point and give it a go. This is this part of the video is more the sort of unboxing-y part and setting it up and seeing what it looks like. So yeah, this is this is fun, isn't it? I mean, you know, the idea of these things is to sort of just check that you're okay the morning after. I used to I used to go out drinking a lot on school nights, which was very naughty. Not when I was at school. And um, yeah, thankfully there was a train station right by where I worked so I could get the train in because sometimes I was battered. Right, okay. Oh, oh, hello. Right, I'm not sure what's going on. Right, okay, so we've got the uh, setup. Uh, go into English. Okay. Press okay to f start first time setup. We will do that. Uh, Important, set today's date and time. What well, time of recording, it is the 1st of the 12th, 2020. And what time is it? It is 4, 12. Is this correct? The date cannot be changed later. Wow, I mean, it's not offered me like a confirmation. Let's see if I can take that off and hopefully it might glare less of it yeah it does glare a little bit less uh, i think it's correct i hope it's correct let's do this alco sense excel there we go 
uh, volume. I might turn the volume down. It's a bit beepy, isn't it? Okay, that'll do it. Brightness. Oh, can I turn the brightness up so it's easier for you guys to see? There you go. Key beep on or off. We're going to turn that key beep firmly off. There we go. Oh, okay, so you can set the limit. In Scotland and Ireland, it's 0.1 of a percent back. And in the rest of the UK, it's 0.8 of a percent back. I thought it was, I think like on the police breathalyzers, it's like 35, isn't it? That's their, that's their level. Obviously, this is a slightly different measurement. So we'll say okay, because we are in the rest of the UK. Uh, your alcohol reading can change quickly for up to 90 minutes after reading. Wait at least 30 minutes after drinking before testing. Testing quickly after drinking can damage the sensor. Okay, so it's telling me to insert the blow tube. There's an offer. Um, okay, where does the blow tube go? I don't really want to... I think we're going to refer back to the manual. I assume the blow tube goes there. A sigh until the beep. <sighs> Okay, so the blow tube, ah, right, I see how the blow tube goes in. The blow tube does go in said hole. Right, okay, the bigger end goes in. Yeah, that makes sense, fair enough. Okay, well, I'm not gonna waste a blow tube yet. Put that down. So when you've got it down, it just gives you a little display, it's a bit hard to see, there you go. So it says it's ready, it's got the date and the time, it's got the battery level, and, uh, Oh, it's got a menu. Should we have a look on the menu? So you can see the last results, um, settings, or info. So let's go into the settings. What settings, I guess? Okay, so it's just what we were asked previously. Um, you, you can change the date and time. Got that mardy little notification that you can't change the date and time, but you can. That's fair enough. Okay, let's go back. Uh, what other stuff do we have? Do we have info? I guess that's software version. Yeah, that's just the software version. I mean, it's a nice little, it's a nice little device. I mean, what can I, I don't have any, oh, I've got a, I've got a Sky Remote. We can compare it to the size of a Sky Remote. So it's not that big, it's, it's a bit thick. And then when you wanna do your blowing, you can just slide that up and it just uh, gets ready. It does a little countdown, I guess to, you know, warm the sensor up, is that, is that a thing? I don't know. There we go. It's ready. It's ready to take a blow. So, uh, yeah, what I'm going to do is I don't know if I'm going to drink anything tonight. It is during the week. I don't usually drink all that much during the week. Um, but I might do for science. So, uh, yeah, come back later and uh, we'll see. We'll see just how alcoholed I am. But I will wait at least 30 minutes before I blow. Or it might be tomorrow. No, it's not going to. It might be tomorrow night. I'll, I'll be back anyway, so see you in a second. Well, you join me several hours later and um, I've had a few drinks, perhaps slightly red eyes. So uh, I've waited the allotted time to uh, take a breath test. So that's what I'm gonna try and do one now. There we go, I've inserted the blow tube. I think that's right. And I've got to blow until I hear a beep. Are we ready? There we go. It is analysing. It's analysing. Oh, there we go. So, I'm in the uh, I'm in the yellow zone, which is sort of be careful. I've had a rather large beer and a double gin and tonic. Yeah. So it it does the job. I don't feel confident to drive a car, and this suggests I should probably think twice about it. So, it does what it's meant to do. I'm, uh, I'm quite impressed by the old Alco Sense Excel. Yeah. So there you go. I got to play with a gadget. I got to drink alcohol, and I got to make a video. It's like it's like perfect. All I need now is like some some pizza or something and it'd be like the best night ever but there you go so yeah i definitely recommend the alco sense xl it's uh does what it's meant to do can't argue with that can you so uh, yeah thank you so much for watching don't forget to uh like and subscribe and i'll be back soon for some more vlogging fun see ya